Welcome back, dreamers, to another episode of American Dream TV. I'm your host, Milton Andrade, and today we are going to have a special treat for you, a double banger. We're going to be meeting with an entrepreneur, a homegrown Miami entrepreneur that really, really embodies the American spirit. And then we're going to take you to the neighborhood of Midtown, and we're going to be visiting specifically for Midtown, where they have loft-style, beautiful residences. Stay tuned. Now, guys, I have a special treat for you. We're going to do a great interview with a good friend of mine, Victor George, the man, the myth, the legend, a homegrown Miami entrepreneur with Victor George Spirits. So follow me. Hey, Victor, how you doing, my Mel, friend? Mel, what's up, Good what's to up? Good to see you. Good Long see time you, no speak. Yeah. I'm really proud of you, everything that you have accomplished, and I want to know more. All so right. let's have a conversation. Appreciate it. Let's go. Victor George is one of the first African-American owned spirits companies in the United States. Victor, tell me a little bit about your journey and how did you come about this? What's the mission behind it? Uh, we started our first company in 07 and, you know, we were forced to get out of that one, you know, due to some other things that happened. And, uh, you know, it was, it was a tough time, you yeah. know, as, as you know, raising two kids by myself. Uh, and I just stayed focused on that. And uh, once I got them into college and things like that, my daughter actually came to me and said, you know, Dad, it's time for you to get back into the spirits business. That's what you enjoy doing. And uh, so we got back into it and uh, I launched the first vodka, Victor George, in 2020, uh, which was a surprise, obviously, because of the pandemic. Yeah. But for us, it was a blessing and a curse. Uh, you know, alcohol sales were up 327 percent. And, you know, and then when the whole George Floyd thing happened and the call to action to support black owned brands just went through the roof. And we went from one state to 44 states in like three months. And I knew in order to do that, we had to add some additional lines. And so we expanded into bourbon, uh, which is the Fort Mose bourbon. Fort Mose is the first town in America where black people could live free, starting in 1738. And I said, this is it. Success is when opportunity meets preparation. You just gotta be ready. That's right. Well, that's fantastic. Well, you got it all right there, ladies and gentlemen. Well, listen, Vic, it has been a pleasure to speak with you again and to really get to know your Fort Mose bourbon whiskey. And now I want to try it. All right, let's do it. Now, welcome to the neighborhood of Midtown and specifically the building of four Midtown. Imagine back before 2008, there wasn't anything here. This is just a testament to the evolution that Miami has really uh, experienced over the last couple of years. Now we've got high rises, we've got nightlife, we've got restaurants and really have a great quality of life here. Very walkable, it's very pet friendly, very family friendly. Midtown is the place to be. Now, welcome to Unit M306. This is a one bedroom, two full bathroom, beautiful New York style loft in the heart of Miami. Midtown Miami is one of those neighborhoods that really popped up over the last 15 years. It's a fantastic neighborhood, really walkable, great restaurants, and really unique apartments. Now, one thing I want you guys to notice is these 20 foot ceilings. And you notice how quiet it is? We don't hear a thing because this is hurricane impact glass. Let me show you the difference. We can hear the outside. Now we don't hear a thing. That's the beautiful thing about Miami and the beautiful thing about this apartment. It's got all the modern amenities and modern improvements. Now, Fort Midtown has 392 residences, but only 10% of them are this two-story loft style apartment. And at any given time, you may only have about three or four that are for sale. So this is a unique property. Great for living, great for working, and great for play. Thank you for joining us again on Selling Miami on American Dream TV. My name is Milton Andrade, and I hope you've enjoyed tonight's message about entrepreneurship in the Miami spirit and really getting an understanding for one of the best cities in the United States. Thanks for joining us.